D, it's unfortunate another family will be mourning the loss of a teenager so close to the holidays. Hundreds of people gathered by the Spirit Rock on Thompson High School to say goodbye to a friend, student, and family member. Gathered together, arm in arm, people are remembering the life of Omarion Thompson. He was always positive. Every time I, you know, every time we come around, he's smiling and, you know, playing around and, what's up, cuz, what's up, cuz, you know, and he loved playing with my daughter and my son. They were real close. His family says... He was the type of person who will pick you up if you were feeling down. He always makes sure I'm all right or ask, uh, how you doing today? Or he'll just, he's just that kind of cousin that will come and say, are you all right? He loved to like make me like feel happy and make me laugh all the time. People here say they were thinking about the good times with him. I was thinking about his smile and how he always wanted to show us his muscle. Look, cuz, think about muscle. Look, 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 feel it. Amarion's family say every time the area bounced back from one incident, it seems like another one happens. But they believe it's the support from everyone that keeps this tight knit community, Thompson Strong. Everybody that came and supported him, whether the tragic accident, whatever it was, I'm just glad that everybody came out just to support him. To know that we got people that have our backs, you know, through these hard times, we're not alone. We have a community, you know, behind us. His little cousin tells me, even though Amarion is gone, she knows he's still guiding her. I normally see him every day at church, but now that he's gone, that I like really feel sad now. And Amarion's funeral will be this Saturday morning at 10 o'clock in Thompson High School. Be back to you. All right, thanks a lot, Devin.